friends! This is Naomi's Fashion Blog coming to you from Duluth, Minnesota. And here we have little Kona. She's our little pug. Anyway, today I'm still rocking this scarf and I put it around my neck. Did you know that when you're over the age of 50, it's your neck more than your face that starts to show wrinkles? And, um, I know I should just be proud of who I am, but I'm a little bit vain. So anyway, today I tied it around my neck. And we're going to see how my hair held up because my husband and I are invited to a New Year's Day party. And I thought I would wear this one more day and then take it down. So, wanted you to see my cup. It says, it's freak and cold and it's got Lake Superior on it and I've told you this before but I'm gonna tell you it again anyone who uses soap males included is using what the FDA considers a cosmetic or health and beauty product so anything that's considered makeup or soap or lotion and the FDA does not regulate this um, the things you need to look out for are parabens, phylites, which are hormone disruptors, fragrances, because if it says fragrance on there, the company does not have to tell you what they put in there for the fragrance. That's considered proprietary information. Formaldehyde, do you know that the average person has formaldehyde in their body by the time they die? And sodium lothal laureth sulfite. The other thing to look out for is capital P-E-G compounds and that enhances the ability for this for it to um, absorb into the skin but for Christmas I gave my husband this lemon gi ginger lotion and it's made by my friend Leanne Rhodes and she told me exactly what she had put in it she started making her own cosmetics and lotions because she had a lot of allergies. But this has none of those things that I told you about. it. It's lemon ginger and men really like the smell of it. Um, it's got fruit extract, radish root, ferment fillet. I'm not going to read everything that it's got in it, but she's got everything in it plus... I really trust her. So, next time you're shopping for cosmetics, remember to look for those parabens, phylites, fragrance. Stay away from anything that just says fragrance because they're not going to tell you what they used for that fragrance. Okay, Happy New Year!